James Gray. Speaker, the McNulty report identified some 30% savings in rail costs across the piece. Will the Minister tell us what she will do to make sure that if that is to be achieved by closure of, rail, of offices or other ways, that that money will be passed on not to the rail companies but to the users? The line from Chippenham, my honourable friend's constituency, to London is amongst the most expensive in the world, more mile for mile than the Concord cost was. We need to see those, those, those rates cut. We can do that by saving some money in the infrastructure. Yeah. We've made it clear that it's vital to get the costs of running the railways down, and it's also vital that the benefits of those cost reductions are shared by both taxpayers and fare payers, so we can give better value for money for both. If we can achieve savings on the scale uh, contemplated by McNulty, we could, we hope, see the end of the era of above-inflation fare increases. Yeah.